really feel like this has been out of focus for the whole time. Mm. Hi guys, welcome to my channel, Halloween Happy, where Halloween is more than just once a year. How's it going? What's in my hair? Buzz. If this is your first time checking out my channel, hi, my name is Sam. I am a Halloween lifestyle vlogger. We thrive during Halloween. So yeah, if you love Halloween, anything spooky, click that subscribe button, become one of the Halloween happy friends. Little Shabil, I just always bring Halloween into my everyday life. I literally live it every single day. It's just my soul, it's my passion. Hope you guys are all having a great Wednesday, the middle of the week hump day. If you guys want to see what I'm up to, definitely check me out on Instagram. It's Halloween Happy. And I also have a Facebook page, Halloween Happy. I'm on Snapchat. All my links are listed down below. So all you have to do is click them. It's middle of the week and I just needed a little boost. So I was like, let me catch up on the Halloween Happy mail that you guys have sent my way. We're catching up. I visited the post office last Friday. So we're good. Some of these cards I think are going to be from December. I have a few boxes and a few cards and we're opening those today. If you are ever interested in sending a Halloween hello my way, please don't ever feel obligated. Um, but if you want to send a letter, a picture of your pet, my P.O. box is listed in the description box. Thanks to everyone who took the time to uh, send me something. You guys know I'm always so appreciative and always so grateful and I just... I don't know how I got so lucky with you guys. Um, so this first box is from Miss Victoria. She said to be expecting a box, so here we are. And I think she sent two boxes. Victoria, you sweet doll, you. Card here. Aw, 2020. Oh, I never got a 2020 card. You know what I mean. <laughs> Dear Sam, Halloween happy. Hope the coming year is filled with happy times, wonderful possibilities, and many dreams come true. I deeply hope this year and years to come will bring you happiness and contentment. You deserve the best that life has to offer. Your ghoul friend, Victoria. Okay, she also sent a little sheet talking about the gifts in here. Sam, all the Jack Skellington items are from Disneyland in Southern California. All the rest of the items are, are from Michael's Craft Store. Enjoy. What are these little guys? Are these little desk walkers? How fun! Obviously, it's not going to walk because it's on my hand, but we have Mummy, we have Frank, an eyeball, and a little jack o' lantern. Those are adorable. Aww. Guys, Jack Skellington was my first crush as a kid. Oh! Someone asked if I was gonna do Halloween crush countdown. Should we do one again this year? I think we should. We'll see. Jack Skellington was my first crush as a little girl. I literally thought he was so handsome, so dreamy, so romantic. He's just so handsome, isn't he? Oh, I just love this so much. I actually don't have a lot of nightmare before Christmas. Mentioned it before, but it's like hard to kind of collect a lot because I like I tend to focus on like three different themes or whatever. Oh what are these? Oh, I love stuff like this Victoria. Thank you so much. These little light up pins. We have a ghost and a jack-o-lantern. Girl these are gonna look awesome on my jackets. Oh my gosh. Is this wax? He's precious. Thank you so much. I'm going to have to like be careful with him so he doesn't get marked up. Wow. So look at this Disney ornament. It's Jack with Mickey ears, but they're Nightmare Before Christmas themed. Oh my God. How amazing is that? Maybe I'll keep it over here and zoom in. It just has everything. I haven't seen her. Look at how beautiful she is. She has a little boo sign. He's adorable. Aw, trick or treat sign with this black cat. I love this so much. Thank you. Ooh, this looks like Jack Skellington. It's an ornament. Oh my gosh. Are you joking? Thank you so much. This is beautiful. You're right. These ornaments are going to look so good on my tree. One more thing in this box. And then we have a little jack-o'-lantern tea light holder. I love these so much. 
I have them like in a few different sizes and shapes, so this is perfect. Thank you so much, Glue. I really appreciate it. Okay, and she sent another box. Happy belated birthday, Sam. I couldn't fit everything into the first box, so here's box number two. A fun fact about Oogie Boogie. I bought him at Halloween two years ago at Disney California Adventure Disneyland. He has a popcorn bucket. Everyone was going crazy to buy him. Long lines and they kept getting sold out. I got the popcorn separate because I didn't want to get him dirty. I love his ghoulish nature. He is awesome. When I found you on YouTube, I knew he would fit into your Halloween collection. Your ghoul friend, Victoria. This little container with little Halloween jack-o'-lanterns. Says trick or treat. Some spooky spider webbing. You can never have enough of this. Want to spook it up? Throw it outside. Throw it inside. Throw it on a wall. Throw it on a shelf. Literally. You guys have been sending me so many ghosts. I said that I need to start a little ghost collection. Look at how sweet this little one is. Oh my goodness. Oh, so precious. I sent two little ghost friends. Thank you so much, Ghoul. These are adorable. This is Oogie Boogie. Oh, this is amazing. Oh, how fun is that? I've actually only been to Disney once and that was Disney in Florida. Like that's how much I don't really know a lot about Disney. Newly into the Disney world, I guess you could say. But guys, look, so you kept popcorn in this and you carry it around and it holds your snacks. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Life has changed as we know it. Cool, thank you so much. This is amazing. I feel like this is gold. Like this Disney merch that you sent is crazy. He's so cute. He kind of looks like Raven. Thank you so much, Victoria. I really, really appreciate it. You are so sweet and so thoughtful. You did not have to send all of that, but please know my heart is so appreciative of it. A lot of stuff you sent. Thank you. And I will be sure to email you because Victoria is not on social media and I hope you're having a great 2020. All right, guys. So next package comes from Miss Jasmine. Let's see what this is. Aww. Okay, so it says Sam, read me first. Oh my god! Oh, I just saw something and I was like, why does that spark something in me? Okay, she says, read the card first. Merry Christmas, love jazz. So it says Christmas greetings and best wishes for the new year. I cannot, okay, I'm gonna have to show you guys. It's, <laughs> oh, you hear that wheeze? Okay, scary creep miss school. I hope you have an incredible holiday in Salem, and I hope you enjoy your gift. A friend of mine made it for you. I told him about some memories you had shared on your channel about your mom Aww. and I knew I had to do something creative with that for you. Sorry I'm so emotional guys but this is just so crazy to me that someone would like go through the energy and take time out of their busy life to just do something so nice for me. Oh man, I said I wasn't gonna have any crying videos starting off the year. I'll show you guys. So there's a magnet that they made and then there's also a picture frame. So <laughs> if you've been around on my channel, as you can see, here are jack-o'-lantern jingle bells. Now, a lot of you guys will send me jack-o'-lantern jingle bells because they have a significant meaning in my heart. And then there is this woman. She is holding hands with her daughter. For those of you who are new on my channel, like I got my love of Halloween from my mom. That was the only time I was really like happy and thriving as a kid. I know that sounds really weird, but it's true. Like October each year was the best time of my life. Like when I was little, we would always go to Michael's and there was a specific Michael's back in Wichita, Kansas, where I'm from. There's a specific Michael's that me and my mom would always go to. It was like in the shopping center. It was like such an old Michaels. It's not the Michaels that we know today. We would always go in there around Halloween just to look at Halloween and fall stuff. And I remember walking in, you smell the cinnamon, pine cones, the cinnamon sticks. There would always be this song, but there's this song and I'm I'm so dumb for not knowing the title because I, whenever I talk about it, I just sing it. But it's like, oh, won't you stay? 
just a little bit longer and that song would always play when we are in Michaels. I would always remember seeing that I would look at these jack-o-lantern bell necklaces. The necklace was made out of like a satin like a satin small rope and then the jingle bell would be on like the necklace charm. She would buy them for me. So it's the mom and here it says, oh won't you stay just a little bit longer and then this is a little girl and then it has the jingle, the jack-o-lantern jingle bells. Man, that is just crazy. Thank you so much. Just thank you for being so like thoughtful. Like that's, it just, I can't wrap my brain around it that someone would, like, you guys are just so thoughtful. I really have to say thank you for, like, allowing me a space to continue. Allowing me a space to continue to have my mom's spirit live on because I just miss her so much. Life is in here. Like, it's fun, but it's not fun. But it's slowly getting back to being fun. So that's just really thoughtful. I can't believe, like, that stuck with you of me talking about a memory that's happened in my life that's important to me so just thank you so much just means so much to me you have no idea and thank your friends so here we got a christmas card from ghoul megan she's been a halloween happy friend for so long I just love her so much she's always so kind and supportive and her family is literally the cutest look they have their little family photo from Disney. She's probably like, well, you didn't have to show that in the video. Thank you so much, Megan. I hope you guys are doing well and having a good 2020. Charles, and I believe this is a Christmas card. He sent me one last year. Sorry, I'm just not opening it. it has his doll Chucky and Birdie, his pet Birdie, his dog Birdie, wishing us a happy holiday. This dog, so cute. Thank you so much, man. I hope you're doing well. Linda B. Oh, this is beautiful. Season's greeting. Guys, oh. Just a little something for you. Hope you have a bright Christmas and a happy new year. Wishing you a happy holiday season and all the best in the new year. Linda, thank you so much. Linda was so kind enough to give me a Starbucks card. Cool, that is so thoughtful. Thank you so much. This is definitely gonna help out. I've been doing good by having coffee at home, but literally there's like not that many Starbucks here in Massachusetts. Like where are you Starbucks? Literally there's a Dunkin' Donuts right across the street. I'm like, it's probably a good thing though. I'll take it as a blessing. It's a good thing it's not Starbucks because I'd be going there every day. Belinda, thank you so much for sending the card. I hope you're having a good year and that card helps out a lot. So thank you so much for even thinking of me and thinking of my love for coffee. Thank you. Raven, how did we get so lucky with everyone? So Rachel sent a card. Have a blessed Yule. Thank you so much, Ghoul. Sam, wishing you all the best for your upcoming new year. Thank you for all you do. I love your Instagram, YouTube videos, and Facebook posts. Thank you for helping me live my best Halloween life with everything you share. I know this year has been hard, but I'm looking forward to the 2020 spooky season with you. Thank you for being your spooktacular self. Sam and Raven, happy holidays, Merry Christmas. May the joy of season follow you through the will of the year. Love, Rachel. At Halloween Horror, 1031. Two four seven. Thank you so much, Ghoul, for thinking of us. I hope you're having a great new year. I hope this year is full of all of the spooky, the spooky happiness, the spookiest cheer. Next package comes from Victoria, and I think this is, this is Victoria? Sam. <laughs> a Christmas poem. If a jolly fat man who is laughing away flies above you while driving a miniature sleigh, with eight tiny reindeer to pull him along, then face it, your eggnog's a little too strong. <laughs> Still enjoying your YouTube channel. Happy holidays. Stay awesome, ghoul, Victoria. What the heck, ghoul? Oh my god. The mayor from Nightmare Before Christmas. This is fun. How cool. You've, you've like grown my Nightmare Before Christmas collection. Oh my gosh. Aw, and then I can always use little notepads. So many of these that I go through. So thank you so much. That helps a lot. And then she also sent this light up pin. In, which why I said ghoul you better stop is because literally I have a huge pen holder over there with about 12 pins and guess how many of them work none so thank you and I freaking love pins like this I can already tell I'm gonna like the grip I'm gonna like the roll the rolliness of it the rolling rolliness of the ink it's gonna be a smooth one thank you for spoiling me you got two more packages guys Gina by the way guys I got this sweater 
Are we focused? Hello? Oh, that's better. I hope that was in focus this whole time. Found a few Halloween things. So stay tuned because that video will be up on Friday. A little Halloween thrift haul. Cool. Squishmallows. So soft. Cuddle and squeeze me. Collect us all. I've seen this in one of like the comic shops that I go to and I always looked at it. I'm like, that is so cute. Gina, thank you so much. I'm so weird. Like I have so many Halloween pillows on my bed and I have to have like a good pillow for my head, a good pillow behind my back, a good pillow like to put my knee on and then I love having another pillow like this like oh just so nice thank you so much old man Marley looks like it's a little scent diffuser oh that smells good this reminds me of my grandparents smells like mulberry cinnamon thank you Gina and then she sent this cute dish towel it says you say witch like it's a bad thing with a little witch hat that'll fit right in have this little jack-o-lantern pouch zombie land bath bomb this has CBD in it I've actually never used a bath bomb with CBD in it so I'm excited for that I love taking baths I was trying to have it to where some days I take a bath like it's my bath to prepare for the, you guys don't want to hear about me bathing right? all sorts of different ribbons in here to craft with the mansion ribbon uh, jack skeleton ribbon that's amazing thank you so much this is cute a little witch hat necklace says all that and a pointy hat thank you so much ghoul oh wait i didn't read the card how rude of me have a fabulous halloween hope halloween finds you in good spirits dear sam hope this card finds its finds its way to you at the perfect time. I so love your channel and just wanted to show you my appreciation. I'm glad to see someone loves Halloween as much as I do. Here are a few goodies for you. P.S. The bath bomb is just CBD, no THC. Love, Gina. And your Instagram is Sparkle Dust Dreamer, so I will link that below. Gina! Thank you so much, Ghoul. Your box definitely found me at a good time. All right, so a few more necklaces that Gina sent. Aw, says cute but baddie. This one has a few charms on it, and it says happy Halloween. Double-sided necklace where it says bad witch, and then you can turn it over to say good witch. Those are adorable, and I can definitely get some use out of those. Gina, thank you so much again for this, and thank you for the time and energy that it took for you to send this. Thank you so much. So we have one more package and this is from my friend Kathy Haunt on the Hill. Um, I will put her channel and stuff down below. Please check her out you guys. Like I remember when I started my channel, watched a lot of Haunt YouTube channels. She was one that I found and I have just looked up to her. I still do. I really admire her work. She is so talented. She could work on a film set she could have her own shop. She just is really talented, guys. She does this, well, it was their last year last year. Her haunt is so beautiful. It's called Haunt on the Hill. Just all the work and energy that she puts towards this stuff. When I lived in Kansas, we've all kind of like gone through stuff in our lives, but I really miss talking to her because we would have a video chat with like a few of the haunt people and it would be like our little pool chat and we'd video chat, have our coffee and just kind of catch up on what we were doing with like our channels and videos and stuff. She's just so sweet guys. I just love her so much. When I first got my P.O. box, are we in focus? This looks so blurry. She had sent me a Halloween pillowcase that I still use to this day. It's still on my one of my main pillows that I use. I always think of her and she's just a really nice woman. So this might be a new pillowcase, we'll see. Look at those watercolor jack-o'-lanterns. How sweet. Just a note to thank you for the Halloween happy pin. So her daughter Lydia, she messaged me and she was asking if I had any more spare pins because her mom Kathy had lost my Halloween happy pin and I guess she was really um upset about it and so I gave her the one that I wore off my jacket I was like uh yes I do she can have this but she said Lydia just got home for Christmas break couldn't wait for me to open a special package it brought tears to my eyes after oh <laughs> after opening it how sweet of Lydia to reach out to you and even sweeter that you sent 
an extra pin. I was heartbroken when I lost it accidentally for the second time. I'll be sure to keep it safe because like you, it describes my everyday mood to a T. Halloween happy. Enjoy Christmas in Salem. Thanks again for sending the pin and the sweet card. Fondly, Kath. P.S. I thought it was time for a new Halloween pillowcase. After all, I gotta keep your pillow in style. Aw, Kathy. <laughs> I really do think of her like every time I sleep on this pillow. The talent. Oh, look at my new pillowcase, guys. It's perfect. Oh, it's just like Halloween happy. Wow. That is so beautiful. Thank you so much, Ghoul. I just hope you're doing well, and I hope you guys had a good Christmas. I'm so glad that Lydia reached out. I hope she's doing good at school. I just adore you, Kathy, so thank you so much for sending this. Oh, a little sachet. Aw, smells nice. Smells like mm, fall. Ooh, like you just grabbed a blanket. Like you're drinking coffee, pumpkin coffee with marshmallows melting on top and it's gray outside. You're about to watch a fall movie. Not a Halloween movie, but a fall movie. Kathy, thank you. My battery's yelling at me. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I hope you guys are all having a great week. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also click that subscribe button. That that way you know when there's a new Halloween happy video out. Currently, I am trying to post videos Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. I mentioned before, if there's one day that I miss, but if I upload three videos, great. If I if it's only two, I'm not gonna beat myself up. Don't forget to check out the Halloween happy friends that I list down below. If I know their social media, I'll list it down there, so be sure to follow everyone. A big thanks to everyone who was so kind to send me something. It means so much to me. Like, I just, I, it's still crazy, like, when I, go to my P.O. box and there's something there when I'm opening something that has so much meaning to my life that you guys create. Thank you so much for taking time out of your day to make my day. I just love you guys so much. So thank you always for your love and support. As always, thank you so much for watching. I really, really appreciate it. I hope this video finds you having a Halloween happy kind of day and I will see you guys next time. Bye.